I think my personal favorite Adam Hoagland piece so far has been all my favorite people. They collaborated with the band Over the Rhine. I've been in a lot of Adam's ballets, but I think my favorite is All My Favorite People. Mozart's Requiem is so beautiful. I love that ballet, and I love dancing in that ballet. That like totally stands out as one of my favorite things that he's done. It's a really fun, but also slightly dark piece. I had a chance to do a really cool solo, so it had this circus feel to it, but at the same time, it had this sort of really serious music sometimes, so some of the quirkiness came out. It's lighthearted, but also has some dark moments. It's very emotional, and it's just very much his movement style. I think within the refinement of ballet technique, I think he relies a lot on the movement quality, and it's very sweeping, and it's a lot of movement from your back, and it takes the dancing that you would do with a normal ballet into an extreme mode, so to speak. His work is very full body, a little bit unpredictably musical, which makes it exciting to watch. It definitely has a strong sense of classicism, rooted in, in classical ballet, but it's also not afraid to break it. It's not afraid to make a non-classical line to do something that some might think almost jarring, but it turns out to be beautiful in the way that he presents it. His newest work is even more balletic than his past work that I've done, which is a challenge. The steps are quick, and it's definitely going to be a stamina builder for us. It seems a little bit brighter of a work. The music is Beethoven. The string quartet is very busy and fast and virtuosic. I think the steps take a more classical route. It's very much his style, but taking it to another extreme. It's taking it to the classical extreme for sure. So you'll see more classical elements in this piece than you will in almost any of his other works, but you'll almost see even more of that breaking the classicism and, and turning it on its head. So it goes to the extreme, but in both directions at the same time, which is a very interesting dynamic for sure.